I found a GeoGuessr map of exclusively dads around the world doing dad-like things. And so that is what we will be looking at today. Let's do this. The golden rule of taking pictures is that you don't stare directly into the lens as you take the picture, especially this kind of picture. That's like me doing this the entire time as I'm talking to you guys without ever looking away at the scenery that I'm capturing. Imagine that. Well, let's ignore that for a second. Looks like they're in some Middle Eastern dress. Oh, here we go. Islamabad, which is in Pakistan. So we know we're in Islamabad, Pakistan. That's kind of hype. Let's go, baby. Drop it right there. And my guy, Bop. 4,900 points. Next up. Oh, ho, oh, what is going on here? A couple dads had way too many brews. This one's smoking a dart. And then we got this one just bucket naked on the ground. Looks like they're visiting the Grand Canyon. Took a little detour to do the nasty nasty. I don't know why this picture even exists. Like, why would this guy upload this to the 360 Google Maps? I just imagine this is like the funniest gag that they always talk about around the table. Oh, remember that one time dad got on GeoGuessr being naked? Pretty sick RV. I've never been in an RV, but they look pretty cool. I'm going Grand Canyon. That's definitely an American dad, so I think he's visiting, like, right around here. Okay. We were in New Mexico. Oh, now here we have two generations of dads. This could be the grandpa, the dad, and then it looks like the kids are playing. First of all, these things are so nasty. Never let your kids in these things. Like if you ever go to McDonald's and you see those play pens, they're ridden with germs, especially during COVID. So hopefully this was taken before COVID. That definitely looks like the mask from Crash Bandicoot. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? Jataloa. Okay, this is some Swedish shit, looks like. I like to imagine they're related, but they're probably not. And they're just like bonding over soccer or some shit while their kids are playing in the play pen. All these people are pretty fair skinned and they have some light hair. So I think this is definitely Nordic. Let's go Sweden. Sweden, Stockholm, probably not even how they talk. Not bad, we were in Finland, okay. Oh, we love to see this. This is a family with a selfie stick. Dad taking charge, looks like we got the two sons. This kid has maybe the longest reach I've ever seen in my life. That kid's reach, I mean, he should be eligible for a Guinness World Record with that Mr. Fantastic type reach. This guy's just so chill in the background, like he's been here before. I don't know who this guy is. Maybe they're in like a polyamorous relationship or something. Yeah, there's the wife. Looks like they're going cycling somewhere across Europe. He's wearing red, white, and blue, so he could be French and we might be somewhere near like the Pyrenees chain. Otherwise, it could be near the Alps. I could also be completely wrong, but I think this is actually near the Pyrenees. It looks like maybe southern France. Let's shoot it. And I was dead wrong. Okay, I'm having trouble finding the dad here. I see a playground nearby. Can't go near those. Um, not in the car. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at him pushing the carriage. Dad of the year right there. Love to see a dad supporting their child. Low cut socks, khaki pants. Nike fleece checks out. Definitely a dad. Now, my theory is that the dad is pushing the cart while the wife is going for a run and then they switch on alternate days. So right now he's a little pissed off, which is understandable, but tomorrow he'll have his run and the wife will take over. And that's called equality. And where does equality happen? Some may say nowhere. I say in Europe, specifically in the Netherlands, because I think this is a bike path, which would qualify. So I want to go like North Netherlands. Even more north, Norway. I think they're <laughs> I think they're just calling any guy that has a hat on and is slightly overweight a dad, which is honestly a pretty fair assessment of what a dad is. Aha, uh -huh, these bollards. I believe these are like uh, I forget. I'm not gonna bullshit you guys. I actually forget. Let's just go check you. And it was Lithuania. And I feel like I should have known that, and I'm a little bit mad at myself, so I'm gonna end the video. No, I'm just kidding. Let's keep going. Okay, I somehow just got like stuffed at the top of a Walmart in Russia, it looks like. There's not even a dad in sight. There's like a worker. I guess he's a dad because he fits the bill. He's slightly overweight and he's got like hairy arms. So I guess that's what a dad is now. Why am I on the shelf? Like this makes no sense to me why they took a picture up here. Think about what it takes to upload a picture to GeoGuessr. Like you need to have a 360 camera. You have to place it here purposefully. And then you need to purposefully upload it onto Google Maps. And then you need to get approved with the photo. And then you have to signify where you are when you took it. Why does this picture exist? Maybe I'm asking too many questions and I heard that's not good to do in Russia. So I'm just gonna shut my mouth and go Moscow. And we were actually in Kazakhstan. I guess I was overlooking the fact that other countries use Cyrillic which was perhaps a bit racist of me, but probably more so ignorant and probably even more so just a little bit lazy. Now that is a dad. That is the most dad dad I've ever seen. Khakis all the way down, about to chop the sh** out of a piece of wood right here. Look at that form, it's so immaculate. All right, this is definitely Russia. Where else do they cut wood? Ding, ding, ding. Okay, back in Russia, it looks like 
Whoa, my guy, what are you doing in there? Looks like they just did something naughty and they're exiting that stall together. All right, hey, I won't ask any questions. Don't worry, hey, just don't mind me. Okay, definitely Russian. Now this is absolutely beautiful. There's the dad, there's the son. He's teaching him how to fish. And this guy's pissed off because his son wouldn't go with him. Looks like we have a ladies room. Don't know why I need that, woman don't fish. <laughs> But all in all, this is a beautiful place. I'm gonna have to go ahead and say we're in South Carolina. So let's rip it. Okay, very interesting drop here for a lot of reasons. And I'll be transparent. I think we're in Africa and I have no idea why this guy's here. He doesn't look like he belongs quite frankly. Might be like on some trip. Um, there's also a ton of birds nearby, which again, I have no idea why there's like a bunch of birds in this photo. Maybe he's feeding them. There's also two stray cats right near his feet, which is like another thing that I expect dads to do. Certainly a dad, he's got the Under Armour polo. These guys know it too. They're looking at him like, wow, who is this dad and why is he here? I'm thinking this is off the coast of West Africa, so let's probably go Gambia. Okay, absurd guess by the way. This guess will get forgotten in history, but just remember I got nine miles on a West African coast. <laughs> I don't know if this is legal to show. This guy's taking a whiz on the side of the road and his truck looks like it's about to crush him. There's so many things happening here. Every single guy that's watching this video has done this before, but they probably haven't been captured on Google 360 imagery, which makes this guy a pioneer. So I actually respect the hell out of him. That would be a very untimely death to die by your truck crushing you as you piss on the side of the road in what looks like one of the Baltic countries because it looks like maybe slanted metal roofing. So my guess is Lithuania. And I would be wrong. This is of course Russia. Now that is a dad right there. Out there, what is he doing? Seating the lawn in his tank top, tattoo and everything, corner house, good real estate, dead end so the kids could play, walk the dog without a leash. This is prime real estate. My guy's living the life. He's got a school nearby so he could just walk the kids across the street and bam, they're learning. Wait, actually that's not a school, that's a supply chain. This gotta be in the heart of the United States, which is Tennessee. Some of these, it's like, where's Waldo? I can't find the dad. There he is. Oh, this da classic Sunday dad. He just got back from Home Depot, climbing that ladder, trimming the trees, looking at the camera because he has no idea what's going on. He wants to get his ass inside and watch the Giants game. He's wearing a hand-me-down Hollister jacket. This guy wants nothing to do with this camera and that's why we love him. Clearly in the United States, I feel like this could be my neighbor, literally. Have to go ahead and put them probably in Kentucky, but North Kentucky. He was actually Canadian. Ew. This is an absolute beauty of a picture right here. Bald dad with sunglasses with the camouflage and the boots. Son looking into the camera like he doesn't want to be here, but he realizes it's part of tradition. The classic off-roading truck with the slightly younger son who's a little bit more into it than the older son. But at the end of the day, they're going to form memories that will last forever. As they panned around, presumably Mongolia. This looks like pretty flat. It could be somewhere around there. I'm going to go ahead and say like North Mongolia near Russia. Let's actually go Russia. Pretty good guess. It was Mongolia, but it was actually in Mongolia. Oh, this dad's going through it. I feel bad for him. So we're in New Zealand. Uh, there's really not much to say. I don't want to psychoanalyze this guy in case he watches this. What's even sadder than him just walking alone is that this looks to be a really long road. <laughs> like unless his house is right here, he's got a couple miles to go. Now I could be wrong. He could be getting picked up after his shift or something like that. But as far as it looks, he's got a very long road ahead of him. No pun intended but also pun intended. Let's go New Zealand. I am so unbelievably rusty and bad at this game that I'm just gonna end it right now. So if you enjoy this content, make sure to subscribe and leave a like and turn on the notification bells. So see you later.